It seems in retaliation for your pissing all over his nice clean prison, Zinyak is flooding the simulation with hostile gangs from another simulation. Whatever. Body count's never been a problem for me. The big problem is that I can't tell how they're getting in. I'll need you to investigate this when you have a moment. Boss, if I'm gonna track where these gangs are coming from, you need to destroy the relays masking the signal. Sid can help me find the relays, right? Actually, yes. I'm sending Sid in right now. So how do we take down these relays? I'll need to find the relays first. Some areas of the simulation offer a more advantageous mapping point than others. Let's get to one. After you. Usually the missions with Sid are something else. There is a lot of interference at ground level. It is too much for me to get a read. I need you to throw me into the sky. Believe me, I'll do it. But can't you fly? Yes. But I cannot maintain the strength needed to scan the entirety of the simulation and hover at the same time. I need you to throw me into the air. Don't have to tell me twice. Sid making excuses, saying he can't hover and do that. This location should work. One moment, please. One moment, please. Almost. Almost. This way. This is important work I am doing. Okay. Nobody else on your team could do this, right? What do you want, Sid? I want to be compensated for my contribution. What do you want? A woman. Dude, you're a floating robot with no arms. The fuck you need a woman for? I am in the prime of my life. Ah, here is the relay. Surely this must be worth something of value. Yeah, yeah, sure, Sid. Sid is in the best shape of his life. Why not call out the tank? Make sure I'm safe. Look at all these enemies. I ain't got time to be out there with my America gun. I don't have enough bullets, enough ammo for that. Did you just do something? Because this connection just got clearer. And you said thrill killing is a bad thing. I need to scan the area again. Let us go to another mapping point. I'm gonna have to expose myself to all these enemies again. Oh, look at that. I'm cooking myself. But for some reason, my health didn't even go down. I just burned myself and I didn't take any damage, even though he was screaming at the top of his lungs. Throw me into the air again. Will you please throw me into the air? Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. I have it. Let us go. I have been thinking. As compensation for my assistance, I would like to go out on a date with Kinsey. I don't think so. Not happening, Sid. Fine. Then perhaps Shondi would enjoy my company. Dude, Shondi will kick your ass. How do you explain a robot wanting to go out on a date? That's some that's some different thinking, isn't it? That's not robot thinking. Let's use the jet. Since we gotta be up here anyway, right? Why not? Keep my body safe. Don't take any damage. Here is the next relay. This jet just makes life easy. And where's this retro shit coming from? Zinyak must be pulling data from somewhere. As with all the simulations, these manifest from the subconsciouses of the captives hooked into the machines. So whose subconscious are we dealing with? Shondi says the mnemonic mapping is the profile of Johnny. You see? I told you Johnny was alive. I need to look into this, but I'll, I'll, I'll be in touch. Let us go. I am earning this date. I'm lucky I didn't die with that explosion. I could have failed the mission. That's happened to me as I've been free roaming and fighting those things off. I've died inside the jet. These relays have shields, Kinsey. Sid, can you take them down? For the hand of a loving partner, I would do almost anything. I'm not going on a date with you, Sid. Throw me into the shield generator and I will disable it. Go ahead. Throw me into the generator. Hmm. I suppose Asha is also a pairing option. Are we still talking about this date nonsense? It is not nonsense. I am not doing this solely for your benefit, you know. Actually, that that's a new move. That's not what I was supposed to do. If you want the shield down, throwing me into the shield generator is the thing to do. Protect me while I disable the protocols. I am almost done. Do not let me die. It's time to hop right back in that jet. This is just like one of those earlier missions where I had to defend him. Let's try out this version. See if this one is as good as the Screaming Eagle. If I die, please plant a flower where I fall. I'll 
I think the Screaming Eagle is better because after you're shooting for a while, it locks into the enemy. I am almost done. Do not let me die. The shields are down. Tell me more about Johnny, Kinsey. My best guess is that he's here too. Well, we already knew that. You can trace all these gangs back to him, right? Um, sure. I'll just focus on those relays. Yeah, the Screaming Eagle is better. And I think that was DLC for pre-ordering the game. Normally, pre-order DLC isn't really that good. This is the last relay I have found after careful consideration. I am firm in my intent to court Shandi. That's good luck with that. I do not need luck. I am quite charming. And this shell offers a variety of options when it comes to... Too much sharing. If you hurry, you will still be young when you throw me into the generator. Same as before. Just throw me into the shield generator. All right, Sid, here we go. Oh, whoops. <laughs> I forgot. I, if I, you want the shield down, throwing me into the shield generator is the thing to do. I made the same mistake again. I just threw him. And he looks... Go ahead. Is he Throw really... The generator. Is he really 300 meters away? Wow, I, I threw him across the map. How come he doesn't come back over here? If you want the shield down, throwing me into the shield generator is the thing to do. Do I really have to go and fetch him all the way over there? Why wouldn't he just come back over here? You are right. It is best to wait until the shield generator turns itself off. Oh my goodness, I threw him all the way over here. Oh, look Look at that. Now he's you on his way back. You need to throw me into the generator. I know, I know, I forgot. You are right. It is best to wait until the shield generator turns itself off. Sid is slacking on his Mac and he's not going to get that date if he doesn't do what we got to do. Cover me. You need cover? I need the destructor. That's what I need. I'm busting out the tank. I'll be safe in here. I'm not going to lose any health. Since when the Device Kings have giant robots? The Zin appear to have quite a few technologically advanced forms. I am curious why it is you chose a metal basketball for my shell. Come on, it's cute. I have personality. I do not need to be cute. I could use weapons, though. Yeah, give the disembodied voice guns. That doesn't have Movie of the Week written all over it. Just a bit longer. And now that we know Sid is loyal, we should give him something beastly. Almost done. We should make them into one of those robots with the guns. Shields are down. Okay, let me stop wasting my time with them. Let's just take this thing out. What's next, Kinsey? Now that the relays aren't confusing the signal, I can see the source of the influx. Sid will take you to it. Follow me. All right, I'm hopping out again. It's going to be much faster if I run and glide. I was forced to do this mission. I was free roaming and people kept attacking and... You couldn't stop them anyway. This mission had a red... Oh, what the? The fuck is this portal? I don't have time to explain this. Just pick up people and throw them into it. Please have less time to explain things in the future. <laughs> yeah, because when Kenzie explains, it just doesn't make sense. Just give us the basic one line. One sentence. Tell us what to do. Don't go off in a tangent. Well, if it isn't the Stillwater default player... Where is he going? Give that guy a map. Uh-oh. Oh my gosh. Um, the America gun is so beastly that I'm hurting myself. This gun, you could kill yourself with this gun. It's so beastly. Oh, look at that. I'm killing myself. I'm hurting myself. Yes. Well, if it isn't the other still waterfall player, why are there two of me now? Shit, it's the co-op player. Co-op players? I didn't know the CPU could have co-op players. That's some cheese. Oh, I, I was beasting and feasting so much with this gun, it had to cool down. <laughs> the gun had to cool down. Oh yeah, I should, I should hit him with the freeze and then take him out. That'll be faster. So let, 
Oh, uh, look, look at this. I keep killing myself accidentally. You know how I'm always rhyming accidentally? I'm killing myself accidentally in this one. I cooked that guy real nice. Let's take him to the portal. He, that thing is going to close. You've got a warden coming for you. I'll get you out. No, no way. I still have another slot in my power menu. I want to fill it with some. Fine. You know what to do. Oh, yeah, this is going to be good. I'm going to get another superpower. I wonder what this one is going to be. And these guys are easy now. Before, they were a challenge. But now all you got to do is hit them with the freeze, hit them with the America gun a couple of times, and that's it. Oh, he's all the way up there. Look, see, he's scared of me. He knows I'm about to lay the smack down on him. He's terrified of me. He's all up in the sky. All right, let me hit him with the freeze. Can I do it up in the air? Oh, no, I missed him. So let's wait. That bar's full. There it is. Here we go. Got him. And just like that, he's down to the ground. Superpower is mine. Button mashing A. Now why? What does he have? Because he... He didn't really do anything to me normally. Ooh, tingly. Kinsey, I want to take my new power for a test drive. Sure. One moment. Alright, so what can I do? Fire. Particularly flaming bullets. So I guess I don't need those upgrades on the guns then if I can just do this. Saints always what these have been in my dream journal for so long. And it's not just bullets. Try just getting close to people. I set people on fire by just invading their personal space. Kinsey, you are awesome. Have fun. Let's see how this works. Oh, nice. I don't even have to. I don't even have to punch them or anything. All I got to do is just run right into them. They just instantly drop and flop. Now powers activate. I still remember the first time I went up against a warden. It took me forever to take him down. Now all I got to do is just hit him with a little move. Let's switch to this instead of the pistol. Look at that. Nice and quick. 